Remember, guys, we will be doing multiple Destiny 2 giveaways, so make sure you like this video, comment down below, subscribe, and follow us on Twitter. The links are in the description below. <laughs> What's going on YouTube? Snipes here with TKO Gaming, bringing you guys a very quick but full guide in detail of how you can get the Vosik challenge done with pretty much anybody. If you watch this video, if you learn it, you teach it to other people, or if you don't like teaching, let them watch this video. Trust me, you guys will get it done. Now, real quick before we get into the video, as you guys know, you guys can get yourself the last Eye of Eternity emblem that we have. All you have to do is follow our Twitter before we hit 5,000 followers and it's that simple make sure you guys go head on over it takes two seconds follow us on twitter if you don't want to search it go ahead and look in the description below all the links to all of our social media is there so thank you guys for that now let's get into the video so what you want to do is first off diversify the team in terms of characters don't just have all hunters don't just have all warlocks kind of pick and choose get some titans in there get some warlocks in there get some hunters in there obviously the tether is great the Arc Warlock Super is great for clearing out ads on this part and as well as the Titan Bubble which is the Weapons of Light is always always good. Also great for generating orbs. Now what you want to do is divide the team up, two on the left, two in the middle, two on the right. I would always make it so you have two different characters alongside each other so their supers can kind of complement them. You guys are smart enough to make out with what supers should be with what supers. So what you do essentially is go through the damage phases, right? Stay in the back part of the map. Don't push up too far. The only time you should be pushing up is when those SIVA charges do drop. Now when those SIVA charges drop, make sure the person that has self res or is a little bit more skilled is the person going for the bomb closest to Vosik. Once you pick up that bomb, you guys want to time 3 2 1 and throw the SIVA charge over at Vosik. It'll damage him and then you will continue to the next phase. Do not forget the monitors on the top. Call it out. Very, very, very key to have communication. Be going around for the whole group, guys. Do not forget about that. And what you want to do is kind of rinse and repeat. The challenge mode, if you guys do not know, is while you are doing damage to Vosik, what you have to do is towards the end, two more SIVA charges will drop and you have to go pick up those SIVA charges and take them into those rooms that light up and you throw the bomb at the panel to close the room. The panel must be closed by you throwing the SIVA charge at that panel. So make sure you guys do that. That's the only way the room should close. And that's pretty much it. You rinse and repeat. You have to get this done in three waves. This video is really for those that are new to Destiny or don't really have a clear understanding of how to do this. I've seen a lot of guides on this and people aren't as descriptive. So I want to be as descriptive as possible. Guys, another thing you can do is while I'm talking, look at what we're doing, kind of see exactly how we're doing. We are not in any way shape or form a perfect raid group but we try our absolute best so thank you guys for all the love and support that should explain the overall mechanics of this challenge you gotta clean them up in three waves you'll see what we're doing the guys holding the siva charge you're gonna throw it at the panel i even zoomed in for you guys to show you and it closes the room there's if you look across the team is on the other side doing the same exact thing and that's it that's one wave you go next and you can easily easily one or two wave Vazic if you have like sleeper simulants good dps good supers weapons of light tether all that stuff make sure that you guys utilize everything that you do have and then rinse and repeat you're gonna get it done stay positive do not ever put the blame on anybody remember guys it's a team based sport not really esport whatever you want to call it right that's what rating is in a way so what you want to do is have one good leader who's going to make sure that they are fair to everybody be positive because that's what gaming is all about and make sure if you guys can't finish it yourselves you guys come on over to the tko gaming family we'll see what we can do read in the description below if you want a guaranteed run in raids or trials or whatever else follow us on all of our social media i love you guys so much i cannot say that enough 
Thank you for all the love and support. Join the TKO family if you haven't by hitting that subscribe button. That's step number one, guys. And let's see if we can get this video to 1,000 likes. Guys, let's get TKO Nation more involved in growing the YouTube channel. How are you guys going to do that? By dropping likes on the videos, commenting down below, letting your friends know, sharing it on social media, share these videos around. And I really do hope that these videos help you and help others and we continue to grow this family. We'll see you in the next one, guys. Peace out.